Everyone, shut up. I don't care about Overlord or Boruto or whatever other anime is airing right now. It's time we discuss the real culture. That's right, it's Mew Mew time! In case it wasn't obvious, I had a bit of a Mew Mew phase. Tokyo Mew Mew was the first anime I watched and knew it was anime. Scroll back to the beginning of my channel and you'll find some... things? For sure. And it basically shaped my entire online identity. In fact, that's where this name Cake came from. And for a long time throughout middle and high school, I honestly identified with that name more than my actual one. And if you're confused as heck, wondering what the hell's Tokyo Mew Mew, let me explain. Aliens are coming to Earth to claim the planet as their own, infecting animals with these parasites to turn them into chimera animals. Endangered animals, being so close to extinction, have the power to resist the parasites. Thus, five girls are infused with the DNA of these red data animals and must protect the planet. And everyone's named after a food. We've got Ikigo, Mint, Lettuce, Pudding, and Zakuro. The aliens are named Quiche, Pie, and Tart. Why? It's cute, and who cares? I know this isn't going to be talked about that much in the main anime internet sphere, and I wanted to give my own thoughts. And my thoughts are it's gonna be amazing. From one episode, it captures the spirit of the original series, both the manga and anime. It really does feel like this was a passion project, and the people who worked on it wanted to honor and elevate the original story. There were a lot of unexplored things in the original series, and with the original artist, Mia Ikumi's involvement, all through production up until her death, I'm sure the result will be nothing short of amazing. I owe this series a lot. I was bullied growing up and 6th grade was especially hard. I definitely used Tokyo Mew Mew as a way to escape it all. And while I did some... A lot... Of embarrassing things, this is something I don't regret. I can safely say that Tokyo Mew Mew put me on the path to who I am today in more ways than one. Anyway, I'm gonna be watching the original anime again for the first time in years, as well as reread the manga. I also have this dream that in a hypothetical English dub of the series that I get to voice one of the girls, and I know I'm nowhere near that goal, but I'm gonna keep working for it. Woohoo!